Since the dawn of time, every sunrise on the Mudhumuti River, flowing in the bosom of Bengal, has been telling a story of infinite possibilities. Dependent on this river, crows of people had a long cherished dream, and that was a bridge. Ending the long waiting, one golden morning like a white feathered swan came and sat down in the calm Mutumuti. Two sides are bound by historical ties. As it has already started, the morning of a new possibility. It's like a dream come true. Bangladesh is the alluvial delta of Podda, Meghna, Jomuna and Muthumuti that connects South and Southeast Asia and China. The blessings of which have reached 16 crore people of this country. A thousand years of rich culture. Development conscious Bengalis have turned this Bangladesh into a true golden Bengal. With Japan, the land of the rising sun, some 5,000 kilometers away, the country's friendship is so deep that distance is just a number here. The flag of the two countries is a big reflection of that friendship. After its independence in 1971, Japan was one of the few countries at the forefront to recognize Bangladesh. Bongobuntu's historic visit in 1973 took the relationship between the two countries to another height. Therefore, Japan has given the courage to stand up to the 56,000 square miles of war-torn Bangladesh. Joy Bangla, joy Japan. With underdeveloped infrastructure and the curse of poverty, Japan has been constantly extending a helping hand. This year marks five decades of relations between the two countries. Modumuti River's importance is immense in terms of geographical location. The bridge built on this river, which divides the two districts of Southwest, Gopalganj and Norail, will facilitate the communication system of at least 10 districts. The bridge has been built at a place on the river, which is between the capital Dhaka and Kolkata, the capital of West Bengal, India. As a result, this project will act as an important regulator in the growth of international communication, in particular by connecting with Asian Highway 1. It will make connectivity to Southeast Asia easier. The distance between the two banks of the river is not much, but the waiting for crossing was long. Millions of people of this region have to endure unbearable suffering and hardship. <laughs> Hence, to escape this hardship, a dream bridge was long awaited. The dream project, built on a unique blend of cutting-edge technology and aesthetics, has finally fulfilled the awaited expectations. This dream of the bridge has stood up with a unique mix of local and foreign engineers and state-of-the-art technology. Tekken Corporation, a world-renowned company in Japan's railway and construction industry, and Abdul Munim Limited, a leading infrastructure construction company in Bangladesh, Yokogawa Bridge Corporation, another skilled company in steel bridge construction, jointly constructed the bridge under the road and highway department. The challenge is that the extra span Bangladesh is technology. It is not used in the It is a very good technology. 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 It is a 
বাংলাদেশ এবং জাপানের যে পঞ্চাশ বছরের রিলেশন সেটা আরও শক্তিশালী হবে এবং ভবিষ্যতে দুই দেশের মধ্যকার বন্ধন আরও দৃঢ় হবে The steel framed first six lane bridge in the country is called the Nielsen Rose which is a clear reflection of the unique aesthetics within the complex architectural style With the calm flow and pristine beauty of Mutumuti this structure has been built in such a way that from a distance it looks like a swan gliding over the river জাপান বাংলাদেশের যে সম্পর্কটা এটা দীর্ঘজীবী হোক দীর্ঘজীবী হোক